Did this, uh, this background change? That man looks a little new. Like, new to the background, not new to the game, though. I remember him. Okay. Anyways, hello, guys. How's it going? Welcome back to the thum 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 Something like that, I'm pretty sure. Alright, let's do shit. Also, I'll try to keep an eye out for more ghosting. I think it's, uh, I think it could be DLSS, I'm not too sure. Uh, quests have multiple objectives, freely switch for the one you'd like to track. I'm just switching the objective will reveal a path to follow. Sometimes this path is so mysterious it eludes even an experienced thaumaturge. No worries, the remaining objectives will provide a way to solve the quest. Okay. Matter? Right. Sure. So which one should I do? Just do this one, I guess. Then we can find Rasputin. Oh yeah. I felt something. Where is it? There are gawk, but without lifting a finger. Just Vesna will bring it. Vesna will help. But if Vesna needs help with something, there's nobody to be found. Sucks, lady. That's not yours, don't touch. All these newcomers causing more problems. So, did she spit at me? Rudely? Dropped apple, a bruised crimson apple. Vesna was trembling, dropped a fruit basket, and left this orphan behind. Vesna has left her distinct trace on the fruit. It consists of a heart fluttering in panic and a throat painfully clenched. A bite of this apple would taste of pure fear. I was gonna say, how do I get rid of that? Oh, what is O? Uh, did we... Did we get a level up? Oh, yeah. I was looking for that. I was looking for the numbers somewhere, like in a fucking corner, like a dimwit. Oh. Huh. Okay, what should I go for? Should I like, put all my points into one? Looks like I'm gonna get others, but. He did mention heart while ago. I'm gonna do heart. Even though we already have an extra point because of us being a bit of a dick. Oh, hello. Excuse me. Thought I was following I the other quest. To to the local cemetery. Could you give me a lift? I've only just come back from the post office this morning. I'm not getting the horse going again. Back to the cemetery. Wait, this is the other quest. I didn't want to do that. My horse is more dead than alive. I'll be right back. I don't want to leave yet. Manipulation. Using thaumaturgy, you can manipulate other... What the fuck just happened to my throat? Um, first you must know a person's secret, which you can learn by making conclusions. If the manipulation is available, the character interaction will change, and the upir will appear next to the character. Okay, I'll uh, try to remember that from when I do it later. What is, uh, what is G? Oh, this is telling me about Rasputin. I think it might be. I'm not following that anymore. I feel like it's sending me to the coachman. Am I sensing? A hand carved in a laboratory painted wooden box. The box is marked with the words of love. Sweetest kisses the name of Vesna and Luca intertwine. Cuddling tenderly against the wood, against the delicate carvings, trying to protect them from damp and rain. 
from all the evil the world carries with it. Trace unknown. You know what, fuck it. Out of curiosity, I think I'm supposed to be exploring this, looking for things like that. But does this lead me right to the guy that I was just talking to? Because it doesn't have like a definitive place to go. Is it trying to lead me to that one? I just want to experiment because that's what it said in the tutorial. And I'm pretty sure. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it is. Okay, that's fine. I just got to spam right click until I find more stuff, yeah? Sensing. Is that a dead goose? I was going to say duck. Uh, somewhere something strangled this goose. From the goose's twisted neck flows the anger and passion of the person who slaughtered the poor bird. The wave of emotions carries no desire for meat or feathers. Only the sour taste of envy and the desire for all of Bogdan's property to go to hell. Cool. Should I talk to the wise woman? Over my dead body. I reject this verdict. Well, I expected as much. And he wanted to come see you himself. He was first to judge. I said what I said, and I won't change my mind. Go away, you're attracting gawkers. Not I'm a gawker. Gawkers, a witness. And let him listen. He'll see it fairly. I'm a witness. Sir. This liar and thief here stole a memento of my mother. And this witch says I'm supposed to hand my goose over to him too? How is this uh, my problem? Because you strangled mine. And what do I care about some trinkets your mother left you? Because we already know you strangled the goose, but you still haven't proved that Bogdan stole your pen. Where is the justice here? I'm not Batman. The conflicted neighbors, a dead goose lies between the quarreling peasants. The obvious bone of contention here, if the wise woman is to settle the dispute, she'd better do it quickly. It will come to fisticuffs in a moment. What is this? Seems that the neighbors quarreled over a goose strangled in an act of revenge, a classic of the genre. A lot of, a lot of goose, geese die from revenge? Let's use our heart. Why don't you relax and listen to the words of the wise woman? Well, all in all, it's... I'm sorry, Bogdan. Come inside and tell me what you're doing here. Was that a good thing to do? Or was that a bad thing to do? Is there any other cool stuff? No? Okay. Can I? I don't want to read. Jeez. Why the fuck are diaries so good? Diary of an oblate priest. They say that every nation has its demons, its ghosts, uh, its phantoms, ghosts, and nightmares were created to make naughty children behave. But I've gone halfway around the world preaching the word of God and learned the truth. These demons, fiends, and devils cursed by God are real, and they are everywhere. In distant Sirmia, people whispered the name Bukovac, a cruel beast whose presence brings wrath and commands people to inflict violence on their neighbors. A fairy tale, you say? But I've seen Bukovac here in Pietigorsk. I heard the rattle of his chain chains and felt his fangs digging into my neck and tugging at every fiber of my soul. And I felt the fury, I was going to say furry, that is the wraith brings with it, the anger from which there is no escape, the taste of blood in my mouth that no prayer can erase. May the holy walls of the oblate church stop this beast. Blessed virgin, keep me safe. Fuck you. So-so. My dear son, my heart is crying. Have I harmed you so that you write about me like this? That you renounce your legacy, your land, and your blood? I never said a word to you when you refused to farm with us, nor when you went to Tiflis to study. And now you're calling us stupid? Backward? You repeat after that rector of yours. Su ah, fuck you. That Georgian. 
your language. Is this the language of dogs? And you want to write to me only in Russian? Child, Georgia flows in your blood. She is the salt in your tears and the glue in your bones. You will not renounce her. You can't. Why is it unfinished? Hello. The villagers seem to have a certain respect for you, ma'am, so I wanted to ask your help with something. I'm not getting any younger, boy. Talk before I drop dead. Uh, how long will that take? Huh. Why are these... Okay. Uh, why are these uh, magnifying glasses and this uh, one is not... Keep searching. Uh, oh. Well, then I need to look for more clues. Get back, okay. I was unaware. She told me to follow her. I didn't... You know, my first instinct was to find uh, more more stuff. So that was... Uh... Oh, fuck. I almost got stuck. Oh, good then. Just gonna I knock on to random talk. strangers' Mom, doors. Please open the door. Please go. We didn't invite any guests over. Vesna, wasn't her name on Ellen, something? Go away, or I'll call for help! 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 Somebody help me! What are you doing here, you tramp? This is gonna be a fight. I'm not looking for trouble. I just wanted to talk. We'll talk, all right. I'm fluent in this language. Adjust upgrades? Skill upgrades. Each skill can be upgraded. Place the upgrade in the designated spot on the skill icon. Each upgrade takes some space. Choose wisely. Okay. Gamble? Where, where, where do I drop that? Flaw? Many people have flaws, but only thaumaturges are aware of their existence. Really? Okay, that's crazy. These are blemishes on a personality created as a result of turbulent experiences. They attract salutors and allow young thaumaturges to make a pact with their first salutor. Your flaw is pride. If you nurture it by making the right choices, it will impact the course of events. I'm unsure of what that means. Oh, oh, I, I put it on, uh, okay. I want to put this one on here and this one on here. Strong attacks and focus. In order to launch a strong attack against an enemy, you must take away all of their focus, causing them to enter the breakdown state. Strong attacks are much more powerful than other skills and allow the fight to end quicker. You know what this combat system reminds me of? Um, I just, like, there's a new Saga game coming out in April. So I was going to start playing Saga Scarlet Grace or some shit. And I played about, like, ten minutes of it before I started playing more Final Fantasy. But, um, it had a, a nice little, like, timeline combat like this. Uh, it's like diversion skill to lower. Okay. You and your solid tour each have your own separate set of skills. Plan which one you want to use and give the solid tour an appropriate command. Okay. Eerie intoxication inflicts damage, restores your health by zero. Okay. He's lost focus. Strong attack opportunity. The enemy has lost all their focus and is now in breakdown state. It's a great chance to launch a strong attack. Is this a strong attack concussion? Fuck it. Is he gonna wonder about what that was? Okay, um... 
60% chance of dealing double, but this can like fuck up his attack. 50% chance, and I can hit him before he hits me, so let's give it a let's give it a try. And our buddy. Honestly, just that again. It did not work. I was in the bad 50 this time. Um, let's try it again. That, I think it did. I think it sent it back. I'm not too sure though. Also, like a saga game, does your health like the devil reset after each fight? You say that. Sure. Can't believe I'm comparing this game to Saga. If thinking interferes with their actions, so much the worse. Uh, so much the worse for thinking. The locals are impetuous, irritable, and eager to pick a fight for even the most trivial reason. Something is not right here. Thought that was just uh, gameplay. Can I go in here now? I wanted to talk. Ma'am, please open the door. Please go. We didn't invite any guests over. Please leave. Please leave. Okay, fair enough. Is there a way to check actually if my health is still lowered? I, I don't I don't know. I, I do believe it resets after each fight. The wise woman's cottage. Maybe there's some stuff in there that I missed. Maybe it's something that um I can't finish at the moment. Uh, what was it? Just journal? J? I gotta collect all the items. So far, we have a we have dropped apple. Is there is there stuff I'm missing over here, or do I need to continue that to finish up this? I could go talk to that woman and bring up the one thing and see what happens. Oh wait, this is a thing. Salt on doorstep on one of visitors. Uh, oh, I've I've seen Supernatural. I know what that does. Maybe there's some shit I missed in her like actual home. But possibly not. Speak before I die, okay? Sorry. I've been going in so many. Um. A lot of people benefit from your wisdom. They're superstitious and timid, as far as I've been able to figure out. Easy to control, right? Pot calling kettle. That, my boy, that you can ask that charlatan with fancy dress and beard. Who takes advantage of who here? Bah! The people here are believers, of course. But the spirit in the village is real, too. Is this spirit you're talking about, not a person? I heard it howling. That's nothing human. One evil spirit here persecutes people, and you can hear it now and then, sometimes. Tragedies attract it, and impure thoughts. We here call it a Bukovac. But other places probably call it other things. So that's a cha. An evil spirit's an evil spirit. 
He torments people and turns their weaknesses against them. The coward. If I told you I could get rid of it. I'd say I'll believe it when I see it. And I'd ask, how else can I help you? Okay. Well, then, I well that's all I can do for now, man. I, I don't know how you can help me. I apologize. Have a good day. How would I get into what's your name's home? Maybe I need to uh, circle the house while right clicking. I damaged axe shaft. Trace uh, bears does not belong to Vesna. Although it's already becoming moldy from the disuse, it carries the memory of the spirit of the one who wielded it. A loner by choice with a disposition as tart as juniper berries. The shaft is overgrown with thorns of bitter words, but there are others, warm, delicate as rose petals. They betray a love for someone who's not afraid of thorns. A love of some uh, a love that is difficult but not accepting of violence. Sorry, I was I was putting my leg on top of my other leg. Um dish shards, broken shards of a blue ceramic dish. The broken ceramic trembles with anger and frustration. The Koro erupted suddenly, spewing out a bile of mutual complaints and grievances. Its sweet and pungent taste stup stupefied, compelling screaming, finger pointing, and hurting. The frenzy lasted until all involved were out of breath. I think there was a domestic. Domestic squabbles in this house lives a married couple who do not mince their words. They argue violently, loudly, until they are out of breath, but they persist together despite everything. So, um, how is this semi problem? Oh, we got another. I should probably put put more points into this, right? For the plot. But uh, this looks like it also adds to the plot. It looks like it gives me a heart. Which I don't exactly need right now. What is deed? It's perception? Oh. Fuck, never mind, never mind. That's all that they all say perception. Um let's just say Let's go with this one. How long is this game if I can uh, fill these up pretty quickly? Billable upgrades, relaxation, um, stores your focus, reduces focus. I wonder what that'll do. I'm curious. Um, so does this matter? Am I? What am I doing here? I wanted to talk, ma'am. Please open the door. This doesn't seem like my business. Please go, please. Please, 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 please. Okay, something doesn't seem right, but what the fuck can I do right now? Now, with these three things, am I able to speak to the woman? Do you think one of them is being haunted by the Bukovach? You've been going in. Okay, never mind. Well, I think I should not. progress with uh, Rasputin's quest line. <laughs> yeah, you see that fucking blur that was behind him? As soon as he moves after something, it's like a quick one. A little quick blur. It's not a big deal, but it's slightly noticeable. Um. Yeah, I think I should just continue with that. The only thing is, I don't want to like... Progress in one thing and lose uh, access to another, but it, it's I think it's all the main quests, so Yeah, they're they're both the same quest fuck you. I'm, I'm out of here pretty sure it mentioned that in the fucking tutorial, but for some reason I was Under the assumptions it was two different quests uh, protective charm Okay So it's gonna be like little things that just give me experience points that's pretty cool. 
Wait. A shovel. All right, we got a shovel. Wood. It's a rag. The coachman used the rag to wipe the sweat from his forehead. The rag reeked of the sour odor of fatigue. Attempts to free the wheels from the soft soil made the spine crack like a fishbone, and the muscles burn with fire, and no one would help. Such was his job, such was his fate. He's fucked up. He's tired and weary. He's worked hard at unloading the wagon alone, and all he dreams of is his moment of rest. I can relieve his suffering. <laughs> what the fuck does that mean? <laughs> Why can't we just let him take a little nappy? All right, let's manipulate him. Anywhere. I don't blame you, bud, but why are you still here? Oh, we can just do that. I okay. Maybe you'll change your mind and drop me off at the cemetery after all. Hmm? Well, on the other hand, this place isn't much more exciting than the cemetery, and I meant to take the horse out for a ride, so get on. Okay, um, so this is the first area, you know, this is cemetery, cemetery. Sorry, I am paying attention, I swear to, swear to God I am. Uh, it's Rasputin, but should I look for clues before speaking to Raspi? No, we should talk to Raspi. You're alive. Does that mean I helped, Thamaturge? Did he help? Possibly. I will thank him. I don't have enough words uh, to thank you for what you've done for me. I haven't felt this way in years. I'm glad I could help. I see him. My Upper. He's back. I can feel our bond growing stronger as each moment passes. I'm happy for you. But do restrain your joy. We're in the cemetery. Oh, sorry. When I heard you were at the cemetery, I was sure I'd see you resurrecting the dead. Not yet. Today I'm just praying for rest for Vasily's soul. The whole village is suffering after his loss. He was the elder here. He cursed this place. Since he died, darkness and misfortune have hung over the village. Hey. See, to them, every harm comes down to witchcraft. They believe that after Vasily's passing, the village was possessed by some monster that howls at night or some other yuffiets. So that's the thing we saw in our vision dream, right? Uh, we'll say that the death of the village elder, a doom has hung over the village. Minor quarrels immediately turn to bloody fights. The people are tense and withdrawn. Things are not looking good. Yeah, we've experienced that. Do you think the couple was like that before all this shit happened, or is that something new? What changed in the village after the elder died? It's all dreadful, sir. Everything's gone topsy-turvy. When folks get to arguing now, they're so hot-headed. Before you know it, they're at one another's throats. Ladies have no patience for kids, nor lads for ladies, nor neighbors for neighbors. Any word might seem offensive and like an insult waiting to happen. Then you've got to fight. Tragedies such as Vasily's death leave their mark on everyone. It takes time to come to terms with something like this. That doesn't mean this place is possessed by dark forces. I mean... Raspi, I think you're in the wrong here. How did this elder die? There was a fire, sir. Flames shooting sky high, and him burning, swearing, speaking curses. And the curse stuck. Those ruins seem a profaned place now. A wicked spirit has taken over the blighted land. Don't encourage her. Once she gets going, it can't be stopped. This could also be the work of a salutar. We have the same eyes. Mm. Um, Vasily's death was not peaceful. The elder died in the flames that consumed his house. 
The ruins are thought to be cursed. The locals speak of them with her horror. As you were healing me, I had a dream, a vision. But on the borderline of sleep and wakefulness, I thought I saw a salutor. That's what might be influencing the villages and wailing at night. They're good people, but none too bright, Victor. I'm afraid they might be talking about a train. The wise boy was saying the evil spirit is a book of hatch. Does the creature hunting you rattle chains, slither around, and have a mouth full of giant fangs? A book of hatch. Where did this elder live? I'll show you. Let's allow Vasily's soul to rest for today. Amen. Amen. A woman in the cemetery claims that the village is haunted by a lich. His name is Bukovac. Peaceful and happy village? Not quite. The villagers are riled up at the point of breaking, laying the blame for their troubles and the actions of Bukovac. They are trying to defend themselves against this dark force with folk methods. I'm gonna walk around and see if I can find uh, experience points. Oh, oh! You will be mine. Secret. Never, never mind. It's the only. I don't have that. I don't have that one yet. I doubt there's anything over here now. Okay, let's go back. But if I level up, I need to remember to come back. Uh, also, can I go to the uh, inn? for the other shit oh we have a map I'm gonna go back here just so I can go in the end and see if I can get the rest of that Rasputin stuff solely to see if I can get some experience from it Maybe not. Maybe it is... Oh, I need dimension for both of those. Fuck you. <coughs> okay, um... Yeah, we should just go to the home instead of trying to deal with any of uh, that Can you feel it? It's the smell of mystery. Fear. It's a ragdoll. The doll is caked with hard crust of fear. Its layers are like varnish on an age-old painting. A child's fear, a child's terror, a young woman's dread. They form a cocoon smelling of turpentine that constricts the throat and forces tears from the eyes. Okay, we're about to level up again so I can get that, that, that deed. What do you expect to find in this place? The fire was almost a year ago. Eh, time doesn't matter much here. I'm looking for clues and personal traces that will lead me to whoever is carrying the floor that lured the salutor here. I see. I thought I could be helpful to you, but... I don't really understand what you're telling me. It's okay, Raspy. Above all, flaws are deeply hidden marks left on human souls. They form under the influence of tragic events. What does that have to do with salutors? Is that Latin? Yes, from the word newcomer. People have always taken salutors to be spirits, demons, or imps. Like from those fairy tales, the wise woman and the other old crones tell the locals. Sometimes. Those sorts of fairy tales and legends describe how humans perceive the salutor, 
they don't take a physical form. Salutors are attracted to the flaws hidden within people. Thaumaturges discover these flaws inside someone, bring them to the surface, and adopt them to lure the Salutor. Those are the moments when I visually failed. I haven't been able to hold on to a Salutor. I didn't know how to bind one to myself. What about you? Do you have a flaw? It doesn't matter. Why would we the tell him that? The thing is that I can now catch my next salutor. Make another bond with it, and its power will allow me to start influencing people. Thanks to your help, I can once again discover people's flaws and the salutors hiding behind them. And I think I'm now able to catch my second salutor. Is he gonna remember that I wouldn't tell him what my flaw is? My weakness? Individual bits of their personality, even on everyday objects and such. I can decipher the thoughts and actions imprinted on these objects, and then match them to their owner. This lets me gather immense knowledge about a person, especially if I need to find someone. What else can you do? If I do manage to catch another Sadita, that would be a very rare occurrence, in fact. An ordinary Thamaturge wouldn't even try it more than once. Only a few have multiple Salutars. Why? Maybe we shouldn't constantly feed our pride. Some have lost their lives trying. Because that didn't sound like a really good sense. answer. I was close to madness. I lost my sense of reality. I didn't know what was true. But I know I can do it. I'm almost a hundred percent sure. Isn't this exactly the sort of thinking that caused your problems that led you to me? It doesn't matter anymore. Then what's changed? This time, I've got you with me. Why did you want to come here with me? I have never gotten to know a thaumaturge so closely. I'd like to learn as much as possible about your abilities. I need to look around this place a little more. I won't stop you. Hey. A destroyed door frame. By some miracle, it survived the fire. Also, by some miracle, it survived a year of sitting out here. Thick lines of the wood grain are visible on the frame. Um, they arrange themselves into words carved sharply as if by a chisel. They scream about an attempt to break down the door, about the hinges finally letting go. They scream into a space that doesn't respond. Fear has embedded itself deep into the fabric of the doorframe, fear of the flames, and trepidation about losing a loved one. Dried blood stain is soaked deep into the burned boards of the house. The blood sounds like suffering. It flowed quickly. The wound inflicted with the scissors wasn't large, but it was accurate. Life left the body, the heart went into spasm, and the mind recognized the end. It lasted for some time, and the flames came, and the pain resided out. So he was stabbed? Or like cut with scissors? Just said the wound inflicted with the scissors. Could have been a stab. I would assume stab. How do we speak to this thing? House was always full of fear. <coughs> its owner was still alive when the house got fire. Someone wanted to kill him. The fire only covered up the crime. to the floor that you attached to, didn't it? I'll find you when I track down the murderer. I know who owns this doll. Maybe I should give him back to her. She ought to know more about what happened here. It's Vesna's doll? 
seeing Vesna stabbed him? Vesna smells of fear. Her nerves are badly strained. Her heart is trembling. Her fingers are stiff from anxiety and her mind wanders. Lost in the wilderness of fear, I may be able to find her home and discover what's behind her jittery condition. Victor! I hope you've got what you want now, Thaumaturge, because I think it's time to get out of here. Why the hurry, father? We're the Tsar's men. How about the donation for the Tsar's army? There are no Russian outposts here. I think this is the guy with the nice boots. You're the guy who trashed our comrades? I just feel like I should not be, you know. This doesn't look like a fair fight. That's why we're giving you a chance. Make a donation and we'll disperse in peace. I didn't say the advantage was on your side. What the fuck? Rasputin! Okay, I don't think we have any, uh... Nah, we're good, we're good. Okay. Sixty percent chance to deal double damage. What the hell? Oh god, I'm getting fucked up. It's okay, let's think this through. He's at two. Let's quick attack him. The more health points, the higher the damage. Okay, we'll go ahead and target this guy. And give me some health back. See if I can stop him. I don't think I did. Uh. We can stop him this time. beat his ass oh also help you in a fight can you manipulate people and cast these demons into their minds I feel like I could have handled that fight a lot Generally better speaking, but yes oh well we sure won you're right, sir? for now Call me Grigori let's head back I have to visit someone in the village who can tell me more about what happened here Boop. I just like to hear the snap Okay, let's go pay Vesna a visit. Maybe this time when she tells me to please leave, we can actually... We can say some shit. Now I know that woman's trace. Vesna and her husband both left traces of themselves in Vasily's burned-out farmstead. Luca sincerely loves his wife. You think he loves her strongly enough to kill for her? 
You're right. It'd be better to ask Vesna about that. Okay, so I can do this now. Nice. I feel like now that I have one in each of these, it may be okay to start investing in uh, Upir, Upir a bit. Just a, just a tad. Also, I have a gun I don't know how to fucking use. Figured it out eventually, I guess. I wanted to talk, ma'am. Maybe after the prologue. The Please go. We didn't invite any guests over. Please open the door. I'd like to have a chat about your husband. He'd better not be here when he gets back. He's not as talkative or polite as I am. Uh, it's clear that this is not the first time Vesna has threatened someone with her husband. Luca must not have the best reputation in the village. Residents see Luca as a sullen churl and a recluse however he seems to have a soft spot luca was at vasili's house on the night of the murder and the fire took place i know you're scared but please just open the door a crack and let me ask one quick question what do you want calm her down and make her feel safe Please, don't be afraid. I just need to know where I can find your husband. He's chopping wood in the clearing by the forest. Okay. Chopping wood. Oh, that was a... That was a chunk of experience there. Okay. Guessing, do I need to get back on the carriage and go to the map again? I'm gonna assume that's what I need to do. This is probably gonna turn into a fight as well, yeah? Again. This time it's a matter of life and death. How is your search going? Almost finished. I know who's attracting the Vukavach. Can you reveal that secret? It's Luca. It has to be Luca. Do you still want to catch that Salvatore? Yes, absolutely. Despite the risk? I hope I can persuade you to come with me. That's an enormous favor you're asking me. I hope you'll be able to return it. Why do we need I Rasputin? Give my word. He doesn't fight. Did you hear? We're going to see Luca Bogosian. It's fine, I guess. We can talk to him, I suppose. I'm not here to fight. Luca! How did she get here? You shouldn't have threatened my wife. Why did you do this? I don't know what you're talking about. You're the one who brought the Salitor here. The spirit that you all say arrived in the village after Vasily's death. The Salitor is what's making fear consume you all and making you hot-headed. And it's because of your flaw, which has been within you since the murder took place. A murder might just be about to take place. Cut off his head. What? I'll punch you both Cut equally. Off his head before he opens his mouth again. Unless you're the one that killed him. And I'd do it again if I could. Get out of here! Here you are, Bukama. Vesna's flaw is mine, and you are mine. Eh, don't fuck you, don't. <laughs> Don't select that one as the hardest. Was that what it was on the entire time? 
Fuck you. No, this looks cool though. Uh, fighting wild salutors. To defeat a wild salutor, you must get rid of the shadows that protect him. Vanquishing the shadows will weaken him, but the weaker he is, the more fiercely he'll fight back. The bar tells you when the wild salutor sends more enemies against you. Okay. Well, this looks kind of not. Let me get my leg in position. I need to get comfy. Uh. Reduces focus by one additional point if the enemy is in a suffering state. Well, okay. He's got a lot of focus, though. This restores my focus, though. I don't need it. I gotta get that cough out of the way. Um. Yeah, let's give him a nice punch. And let's start on reducing that focus. Okay. Should we just make him... He's got high health. Oh, let's... We're gonna have, like, more enemies and shit, right? Or is that just a different bar than this? I think we just keep... Reducing focus for now. Oh, and that pushed him back. Or no, it didn't. No, it didn't. I didn't use the other one. Ow. Oh. What was that? What did he do to me? It's because you enter the suffering state. States can have a benign or potentially deadly effect. Read the descriptions carefully. I'm suffering. Okay, he didn't fuck up my focus, though. Um, removes negative states from you. I'm assuming that's a negative state, so... Let's do it again. Okay. And, uh... We should hurt him pretty bad. Let's see if we can, uh... Oh, each, each subsequent action that restores health points will restore less of it. Ah. Does, does the Bukovac have a thing? I don't know. Okay. So we have her and this guy. Uh, we can probably fuck up him first since he only has one bar of focus. Sixteen twenty-one. It won't kill him, but if I do this, punch. Oh wait, I killed him. Okay. All right. Oh, fuck me. When did that happen? Ow. Ah, oh, we won. 
Didn't even need to heal. Pro player here. Lose, you lose. We're going crazy again, you blind fool. A little faith, Thaumaturge. Focus on what's true. My voice is true. I am the truth, you see. Look. Taming a Salutor. Uh, you defeat Bakvach, the Deed Dimension Salutor, but you cannot tame him on your own. Rasputin comes to your help. The untamed Salutor won't obey your orders, stops you from developing, and weakens your perception. Fortunately, Rasputin soothed his anger. You achieved the unachievable. Is this a recap or is this a tutorial? I was reading that like it was a fucking tutorial. Okay, well. Unbelievable. I think that might be the prologue. How do you feel? Are you alright? Well, I don't think I'm hallucinating, but that means I'm currently facing a crowd of furious lumberjacks with axes, so I'd say I've been better. What? What? I'm telling the truth. I'd do it again. None of you understand anything. It's because of this magician. It's his fault. The magician didn't kill Vasily. He didn't bring the evil here. You're a witch. To the stake with her. To the stake. Poor guys, I don't think she's a witch. And you, why are you just standing there? Are you just letting them do this? Fine. I'll handle it myself. I did it before and I can do it now. What, what have you done? Go. You don't need to see this. Can I go? <sighs> Prevent Luca from making a rash decision. Force Vesna to flee. Remind Luca of the proof that he loves Vesna. Can I? Can I? <laughs> um, what would be best? Think, Luca. Your feelings for Vesna are still true, I know that. Hear out her reasons before you do anything. She could just be a psychopath. Okay. You two better not come back to the village. Oh, well, no stake, I guess. As if we wanted to. What the fuck were her reasons? <laughs> Okay. <laughs> okay. Well, now we're back here. I was uh, I was hoping I could go talk to the old woman, but I I believe not. Hello, sir. Excuse me, sir. Do you happen to know when the train arrives? The postmaster said it's usually no more than an hour late. So this guy's totally American. <laughs> moment. I got a tougher question for you. Uh, pardon? Will this train get me close to Albuquerque? I'm afraid that's an ocean away. And even to the ocean, you've got a ways to go. Thank you. Ever since I took a wrong turn at Albuquerque, I can't get my bearings. The things I've seen, sir. Places I've been. I just can't get to Albuquerque. That was weird. That was very strange. Okay, um... Oh, there's one here we don't have. I thought we'd go down in order. Um, okay. Restores four of your health points for every enemy in the suffering state. Each subsequent action that restores health points will restore less. So I should probably go and get this so I can have like two things that restore my health. Or, uh, or not. How do I... This shit's grayed out. Maybe I can't even unlock it. Do I need to, like, get here to get here? To get here? Uh, let's go ahead and do a heart then. Wait. 
Uh, perfectionism makes every attack on the enemy deal maximum. Oh, fuck. That's good. 60% chance of slowing the enemy's actions. Bond of Brutality increases the damage of the Solitaire's next attack by 50. Yeah, but that motherfucker sometimes does one. Makes you lose focus instead of taking damage with a 4 to 1 ratio. That's cool. I don't think I've lost focus either. Let's go for this one because I just... Okay, now since we got that done, we can move up to... Action reaction. It's an additional skill. Is that like a counter attack? Like as soon as we get hit, we attack? Huh. Okay. But at least I know now. I thought these were like two separate things. So that's cool. But on that note, pretty sure we're about to wrap up the prologue. So I'm going to go ahead and save it here in this one. And in the next one, I, I unless we're still on the prologue, uh, we'll go ahead and uh, get into the game. The, the main game, I guess. Uh, anyways, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Have a good one. Bye-bye.